Hello there, everybody. I'm Blazer Buck, and welcome back to Blank Dream. I did find something. Uh, a knife. Step the knife into yourself. Now, I don't know what's gonna happen. Maybe, yes. Plunge the knife into her throat. Oh. Oh! oh. That was a nice little glass shatter animation there. But the Oh! Oh, I think she just regained what happened to herself. The girl came to, uh, again standing before the mirror. Though she still felt a nervous, vigorous feeling in her hands, there was no trace of a knife factory wound. Welcome back. How did it feel, killing yourself in the mirror? What's with that look? You got a problem? Come on, I taught you how to get your memories back. Huh? Uh... Mishiro Lucy, 16. I drowned myself in the lake. See? Only partial, but you remembered. Remember your name and how you died. Is that all there was? Look for the mirrors in this world and then break them. I don't know, I usually can't trust things that, like, when the lettering is in red. All across this world are mirrors with your reflection. They reflect your memories. And you, and you see how to break them, right? Just face yourself off in the mirror. Break the mirrors. You'll get back your memories, and at the same time, grant your wish. Once you break all your mirrors, you'll have it all back and can realize your wish. That's the way it works. My wish. Got it? Just don't, don't just look. You have to break them. That's what granting your wish entails. Why is that, you ask? Remember that part yourself. Now find the mirrors. I don't remember why I came to that, but I remember that strong wish I had. To make it so my life never even existed. Well, that's dark and depressing, actually. That's not what I was expecting at all. <laughs> I expected it, it like, it had to do with something with memories, but... Just as Michelle regained a piece of her memory, she felt as if, as if she lost something important. Okay, I probably should save. Okay. The door. Guess we go in. There's no other way to go, so... Uh. You're kidding. Where is this? Huh? Are you new here, maybe? Oh, I picked one heck of a moment to be here. I don't want a suspect, so who are you? Oh, sorry, sorry, here I am, getting all excited. You just came to this world, right? So I bet you'll- I'll bet you're confused. I kind of am, actually. I'm Yuzu. I'm sure you can't remember your name, but don't fret. I'm Mishiro. Oh, that's very polite of- Wait, you do know your name? That's weird. It took me a long- It took me so long for me to remember my name. Where is this? I'm curious. I don't want to be yeah, that a big asshole. This is known as the Mirror World. It seems to be a world for souls with strong wishes, wishes or attachments. I think it's one of those places between life and the afterlife. Maybe... I just found myself here one day, so I can't tell you anything concrete. Souls with strong wishes? The weird thing is, well, I remember having died with some strong, strong wish. I can't actually remember that wish. You have any ideas, Michelle? I don't remember mine. What? You remember your wish? And you know how to grant it? Yeah. Hold up, Michelle. How blessed are you? Gosh, the world's not fair, even in death. Apparently not. Wait, wait, if you're gonna walk around, be careful of the evil spirits wandering here. Because they'll be jealous of a soul who grants a wish, no doubt. Well, shit. Thanks for telling me, Yuzu. So I gotta be on the lookout for evil souls. Are there really evil souls here, though? Yeah, 
man, places, doors are just locked everywhere, aren't they? Oh, hi. I'm not sure I don't trust dark places. Yeah, this is not creepy at all. That's a knight. So no, that's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a mirror. The watchman is a fool who can only judge by number. Can't he at least tell the real thing from a fake? Probably not, but I will see you about that in the next part. See ya! <laughs>